Hey folks, my name is Ravish and welcome back to another video in the series of Terraform Bootcamp or Terraform for Beginners. And in today's video, we're going to uh, get started with Terraform. We'll download the Terraform file and we're going to install it in your system. We'll try to run it. So we're going to use AWS as the cloud provider, but uh, it's not a constraint. You can use any provider, but uh, in this particular course, we are going to talk about AWS only. All right. So uh, before moving further in this video, uh, I would like to request that if you're new over here and seeing this channel for the first time, kindly subscribe to the channel because that would really support me to create more content like this. All right. So let's just right dive into the video. Okay. So the page that you see right over here, how do you get it over here? Just go to your favorite browser type for download Terraform. That's all. The first link should do it. Go to install Terraform and then there are multiple operating systems available over here. So Mac OS, Windows, Linux, FreeBSD and the other ones. So uh, we're going to use Windows operating system over here. But if you have another operating system, feel free to uh, go ahead and do that. So uh, I'll select Windows over here and there are multiple binaries available 8386, AMD64, change login. Uh, multiple other things okay i'm going to download amd 64 because i have 64 bit system all right so let me download it so it's going to ask me uh we're going to save it you can save it anywhere uh what i'll do is i'll just save it over here so it will be downloaded and you can put into some other uh some other okay. folder if you want so what i'll do is okay so this is the folder i have placed it uh let me drag it down okay so just uh right click over here and if you want to see it i'll just create a extra large icon over here and this is a zip format so right click and uh, you can extract it over here it will ask for the extract and then it is extracted over here all right so terraform.exe is the one that you're going to use let me create a large icon copy this path because we're going to use it and go to the start button environment variables so you can uh, edit the environment variables from here you can do it through my computer properties but uh, that would be like a longer task click on environment variables go to path click on new and paste it over here okay that's all you have to do okay okay that's all now once this is done what you can do is just right click over here open a terminal over here it can be powershell it can be anything cmd anything and once you type terraform hyphen hyphen version it will show you the version so you can see this is terraform v1.4.4 so that means your terraform is installed now i am in uh, this uh, this path all right so there could be a reason that uh, you you can have your uh, stuff over in any other folder so let's just check it so what we'll do is we'll just uh, open any cmd any command prompt and here it is and here i'm going to test it so terraform hyphen hyphen version and you can see that the path is set everything is correct and terraform is installed all right so uh, if you remember we used visual studio code last time i'll just open it and if you want to test it over here you can do that as well new terminal you can select the type of terminal that you want to use uh, here it's powershell right now but you can use anything so if you want to change uh, you can use git bash you can use command prompt let's do that and type git version over here not not good version terraform version hyphen hyphen version so terraform is not recognized as internal or external command why this is happening because i have already started it and it is not recognizing so what i'll do is i'll just close this down i'll open it again hit enter and now it's open go to terminal new terminal i don't want this okay let me just clear it cls now i'll type terraform hyphen hyphen version and you can see this terraform v 1.4.4 is done so that's how you do it folks all right so this is the part where you can be confident that you have installed the terraform and you are good to go so in the next video we're gonna talk about uh, a new infrastructure that we're gonna going to create and we're going to talk about uh, the other aspects of terraform as well all right so uh, kindly subscribe the channel if you haven't and I'll see you in the next one.